Okay, this is day 19 of eating on the starch solution, portion control, exercise, review, report. And I'm um, getting to the point where I'm starting to feel like I'm getting close to my true body size and fitness. I did yoga for a half an hour this morning and with Adrian, yoga with Adrian on YouTube. It was a half an hour session and that stretching and it just felt so good. Then I put some lotion on because I'm a bit crepey. When you lose weight, your skin gets a little crepey when you're older. And um, But I'm getting closer to my muscles and stretching them feels really good. Weighed in 131 point ot, whatever it was. And... Um, had a nice oatmeal pancake breakfast. Um, let's see. And later in the morning, I had sushi filling, which is delicious. Um, what else did I have today? Oh yeah, I was. Um, I was. I ran across a video about. Well, actually, a couple videos. But I looked up after I was listening to this one video. What percentage of people who lose weight keep it off? And it said that 90% of people who lose weight put it back, put 90% of it back in three years. So basically, and that what percentage of people actually try to diet? And that's not everybody. So basically, the people who are dieting, for the most part, are, are, are just yo-yoing. And that's been my experience. I just yo-yo back and forth you know, between a weight. But there's one woman who I see on occasion and really pretty girl, pretty tall, but I haven't seen her for a while. She was always a little like heavy in the hips and I haven't seen her for a couple years. I saw her last Sunday and um, she's just very big. She's very pretty. So she's still got that going for her but she's just very very big in the hips and if I calculate the amount of weight that I would be if I hadn't constantly taken the weight off and I'd let it accumulate first of all I'd be very unhappy <laughs> I would feel terrible and and I would probably look similar to, to she and worse actually because I think she started out with a, a better proportion body than I do like I'm really supposed to be like bone thin um, and I did my tape measurements today and they're the same as they were like three weeks ago. I think I didn't measure correctly either today or three weeks ago because I tried on my skinny dress and it fits much better and I'm lighter in terms of weight. So I, I'm looking forward to getting, you know, the tape measure to change. Like my, my waist is 32. My bust is 33. That's not good. Hips are 37 and a half, and my thighs, they're, they're too big. My my arms, too big. They should be about an inch smaller. Um, so in the next, like, you know, juice fast, I hope in the next three, four months, I can really, you know, kind of get those um, really uh, down, see some size down. So it's more proportional. It's like, it's just the way I was built. So anyway, so I did do my yoga. Then I went and I did 20 minutes of resistance training. And I really, you know, really just pulled into the, the resistance. And I did 20 minutes on the elliptical. Sauna, whirlpool. And I ate pretty good. I had that same dinner I had last night. I had the baked tofu with broccoli, carrots, and potatoes. And what did I put in there? I put, oh, I had to put a little of that non-fat cheese sauce on there with some cabbage salad. And then I had, for dessert, I had dates. And I had quite a few dates. I probably had 10 dates. But still, even 10 dates, is calories are not that high. Anyway, and then I had a nice cup of tea and a lot of kombucha. And I bought a lot of diet soda, diet meaning zero. I think it's... um. What is that? Uh, 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 stevia, sweetened, root beer, ginger ale. You know, it's hot here. You know, I've had the air conditioning on all day. It's not super hot, but it's humid. 
And, you know, I, when it gets hot, I like to do a lot of drinking of soda and kombucha and water. Water, yeah. So anyway, so that's my day 19 wrap-up. I'm going to lunch tomorrow at um, Green Gourmet, and they always have very good selections, so I'm not concerned about that. So that's it. Just cruising in, sticking with it.